This video will describe how to use the LED photobiomodulation equipment for mucositis management. This supports the LTHT standard operating procedure for this equipment which should be consulted before use. This equipment delivers visible light from LED probes rather than being a low level laser. The equipment is portable and the therapy can be delivered bedside or in the treatment room. Patients should be offered sunglasses for comfort, but the equipment does not present a danger to patient or operator's eyes. Prior to use, the equipment should be cleaned as per the instructions in the standard operating procedure. With clean, ungloved hands, plug the control unit into the mains electric supply. Insert the key, which will be kept in a box with the control unit, and switch the control unit on. Insert the probes into either probe connection. Treatment time can be adjusted using the up and down arrows. Our protocol is for one minute treatment time per site. Modulation frequency can also be adjusted using the up and down arrows. This should be set to 2.5 Hz. As long as these values have not been changed between uses, they should be preset. Prior to use, the intraoral probe should be covered with a single use plastic sheath. These are stored with the equipment. Pressing the button on the relevant probe will activate the probe for the treatment time set. After this time has elapsed, the light will automatically turn off and the treatment will terminate. We have shortened the exposure time to demonstrate this in this video. In an emergency, pressing the activation button again on the relevant probe will terminate the treatment. Alternatively, the emergency stop button can be utilised. Patients should sit up in bed or on a chair at approximately a 45 degree angle. There are three treatment sites with the extra oral probe. Over the left cheek, over the closed mouth and chin, and over the right cheek. For each of these sites, the LED should be activated for the preset one minute and should terminate before moving on to the next site. There are two intraoral treatment sites, treatment with the tongue at rest and with the tongue raised. Ask the patient to open their mouth with their tongue in a resting position and guide them to place the probe as deep as possible for best effect. If the patient is able, they can hold the probe to give them better control over their gag reflex. For the second position, the patient should raise their tongue to the roof of their mouth and the probe should be guided underneath the tongue. Once in position, the patient can then relax their tongue over the probe for the exposure. Following treatment delivery, the equipment should be cleaned and disinfected following the two-stage process detailed in the standard operating procedure. The clean probes, sunglasses, key and control unit should then be returned to their relevant boxes. Following delivery of photobiomodulation, the paper treatment record should be completed, including WHO mucositis grading. Details of the treatment should also be recorded electronically on PPM+.